Science with Folly. Welcome to Science with Folly. Who's keen to learn about alkenes? Get it? Alkenes? Keen? Yeah. So alkenes are a homologous series of hydrocarbons, and they have the general formula CnH2n. And the key thing about alkenes is that they have the presence of a double bond between two of the carbons in the carbon chain. The simplest alkene is this one. What do you think it's going to be called? It's got two carbons. That's an eth. And it's an alkene, so we use the suffix e. Ethene. Easy. Could you have methane? Think about it. So here are the next two alkenes in the alkene series. We've got one, two, three carbons in a double bond. That's propene. Easy. Here's one with four. One, two, three, four. And the double bond is here. So we'd call it butene. But because butene has two structural isomers, the double bond can be in between carbon 1 and 2, or in between carbon 2 and 3. We have to specify where the double bond is, and we do that by putting a 1 between the bute and the ene, or in this case, a 2 between the bute and the ene. So this is bute 1 ene, and this is bute 2 ene. Now alkenes can have what we call geometric isomers. That means because, in this case, they have a double bond, the hydrogens can be locked onto the same side because the double bond prevents the molecule from rotating. So the hydrogens can be both on the same side or they can be on opposite sides. In this case, when we have both hydrogens on the same side, we call it cis-butene. Cis meaning on the same side, and when they are on opposite sides, we call it trans. So we have cis butene and trans butene. Easy. Quick test. What are we going to call these two molecules? The first one, how many carbons? One, two, three, four, five, six. What's the prefix for six? Hex. So it's obviously a hexene. Where's the double bond? One, two, three. Three. It's in between carbon 3 and 4, so we call it hex 3-ene. And these two hydrogens on either side of the double bond, are they on the same side or opposite sides? Same sides, so it's cis hexene. This one here, let's look at it. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 carbons in the carbon chain, so it's clearly a pentene. Where's the double bond? It's coming off carbon number one, so it's pent one e, and we've got this guy hanging off down the bottom. It's a methyl group, and it's coming off carbon one, two, three, so it's three methyl pent one e. So that was just a short introduction to alkene structure. Next time we'll have a look at the reactions of alkenes. See you real soon. Science with folly. I am with Polly. I am with Polly.